WBO heavyweight championship fight Tommy Morrison and Michael Bent. Bent lost his first pro fight. And the only loss for Tommy Morrison came on October 18th, 1991. He was knocked out by Ray Mercer, but he has won 10 straight since then, and he says he's a much better and much more accomplished fighter. Here we go, round one of this championship fight. Morrison in the black trunks with the stars and stripes. Bent in the white trunks. If he wins this fight, we'll go on to a big payday with Lennox Lewis, and that one hurt. Michael Bent in trouble already, but trying to fight out of there. And a left connected, and Bent in trouble again. And Tommy Morrison trying to end it early. And a good right by Bent, and Tommy Morrison is down at 2.05 of the first round. So Morrison connected and hurt Bent. Bent came back with a right hand and floors Morrison. Now Morrison has been down before in fights that he has won. And now Tommy Morrison gets hit with a left and he knocks Morrison down again. Tommy Morrison in deep trouble here in the first round. And a lot of time remaining in round number one. You can see the bewilderment in the eyes of Tommy Morrison as Michael Bent from New York City looking to finish him off. And Bent just throwing nothing but haymakers right now. And Morrison in deep trouble. And Morrison is down. And the fight is over. Michael Bent has upset Tommy Morrison and has won the WBO Heavyweight Championship of the World. A huge upset in the first round as Tommy Morrison is knocked out by Michael Bent. The young man, 28 years old who changed his name from B-E-N-T to B-E-N-T-T -T when he found out his ancestors spelled their names that way. And Bent with a first round KO of Tommy Morrison. As early on, Morrison had Bent in trouble. But then Bent hit him with a solid right, and then Tommy Morrison was wobbly. The new WBO champion in the heavyweight decision is Michael Bay. A shocker here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, to say the least. You could tell from that first right that Bay connected on that Tommy Morrison was going to be in trouble unless he was able to clear his head. And there you see Michael Bent, who almost made the 1988 Olympic team, but was stopped by Ray Mercer. He was an alternate in the Olympic trials. He went to Jamaica. He won the Olympic trials there, but he would not come in the 88 Olympics because he would not renounce his U.S. citizenship. And so he did not fight in Seoul. He said that was one of his most disappointing moments in his boxing career. And this has to be his shining moment. Here it is again. A solid right started it all. And Morrison was in trouble from that point forward. And Bent came with nothing but huge shots, and Tommy Morrison, desperately hurt, was on his way to a championship fight defeat. Uppercuts, hooks. Crosses everything, hitting Tommy Morrison and eerily similar to the knockout that Morrison suffered at the hands of Ray Mercer. Except for this time, it occurred in the first round. Of course, Mercer's knockout came in the fifth round. And despite the fact that Tommy Morrison felt he was in the best shape of his life, and had been trained hard by Tommy Mercer. Attention, please. Referee Danny Campbell down. enforces the three knockdown rule. The official time, one minute. 33 seconds into the very first round. The winner by TKO and new 
WBO Heavyweight Champion of the World, Michael.